With the absurd season of McDavid this year, it naturally has overshadowed some of the other incredible players in the NHL and the seasons that they're having. One of those guys is David Pasternak. Coming into this game without their captain, Patrice Bergeron, and facing a team that should be hungry for points in my Penguins, Pasternak needed to be a leader, and he was. The Bruins blew not one, not two, but three one-goal leads in this game, and it was David Pasternak who again showed up and really put the Bruins on his back. After offsetting goals in the first from McAvoy and then Rust with a beautiful feed from Crosby, we went over to the second tied up. On the power play, though, Orlov put on a long-range backhand and Pasternak in front redirects it for a tasty goal in what was his 54th of the season and now his 100th point of the year. This officially putting him into the 100 point club for the first time in his career and making him just the second Czech player in NHL history to achieve this feat. Awesome stuff and even as a Penguins fan I'm truly happy for him as this has been a long time coming. See in the 2018-19 year before getting injured he was on pace for a 47 goal 100 point season that that year. Now, would that have come to fruition? You never know. But then the next season, during the 1920 COVID year, he was absolutely robbed, ending up just too shy of 50 with 48 goals and 47 assists in what was just 70 games played that year before the season got cut short due to the pandemic. Meaning he was easily on pace to get not just the 50 goal mark, but the 100 point mark that year. Then for the 2020 21 season, it was a shortened one with just 48 games, so we can't really count that. And then finally, last season, it was a tough year. Even then, despite suffering a devastating personal loss of his newborn son and playing in just 72 games, he still had a strong year with 40 goals and 77 points in what was just 72 games played. But finally, this year, not only did he hit 50 for the first time against the Hurricanes earlier this week, scoring twice in that game, today he finally hit the century mark with this goal and then proceeded to blow right past it. After the Penguins tied it up for a second time this game as Russ got his second of the game. Just three minutes later, Pasternak from Zaka rips home his 55th of the year, even if he was the only one to know it at first. Gensel then tied it up for a third time as he ripped one home, but just moments later, the Penguins try to clear it. It hits the official. Zaka finds it to Krejci, and again, putting the team on his back, Pasternak, with the Hattie and his 102nd point of the year, scores what would be the game-winning goal as the Bees, breaking my heart again, take this one four to three as they win their third of three meetings with the Penguins this year. This puts Pasternak at 56 for the year and again overshadowed a bit by McDavid 61. It's still an incredible feat. Now this win also means that Jim Montgomery set an NHL record for the most wins in the first season by a head coach with 59 as the Bruins already the President's Trophy winners continue their historic season trying to chase down the all-time NHL record for most wins currently at 62 and most points currently at one 32 with six games to go. So again, just as an NHL fan, that's extremely exciting stuff. As always, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next one.